Hey everyone, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm venerating the Space Game lot, the Daisy Hovel, um, which is in Newcrest. And I just decided that I wanted to change it a little bit and making it a little bit, yeah, more playable maybe. I'm um, just looking at it a bit nicer. And I decided that I really wanted to focus on a black, white, um, and wood color scheme with green accents, so um, that is why I chose that color for the windows. Um, honestly, that was like one of the main reasons for that color scheme. Um, I just looked at the windows that I had there, and I thought which uh, swatch would be the best one. And I thought I don't usually use the green, and uh, yeah, I thought why not try to use that one, because I don't usually do that. And I also decided that I didn't want to change too much of the structure of the build, so I decided that I wouldn't change the outside walls at all, and I'm, I'm, I also didn't want to change the windows at all, so yeah, I kept that um, totally how it was. And I also didn't want to um, do too many changes inside with the walls, so I just extended the bathroom or the former bathroom a little bit and I split the kitchen down in the middle um, and turned one side into the actual bathroom and the other one side into the kitchen and the former bathroom I turned into another bedroom so yeah I turned a one bedroom house into a two bedroom house and I actually think it looks quite good the um, layout is the kitchen is a little bit small but everything else I think is okay so yeah I decided um, that that would be um, a cool thing to have and I also decided to actually have a real dining um, table not just that um, like round outside table honestly um, that one I put outside because I know that um, the value depreciates so um, I would have lost money and I also think that that table is a nice outside table so yeah put that down and I also changed the swatches um, of the walls and I wanted to have something green there so um, that's what I'm searching for at the moment the right green I thought the dark one would be quite cool but um, because it's so dark I didn't want to put it everywhere so um, yeah I just used it as an accent color um, in the child's bedroom, I um, used orange, just because I wanted it to be different from the rest of the house, because the rest of the house is designed by the parents, and um, I wanted the child's bedroom to be different. Then I also changed the flooring, and I made it into a dark wood, and um, I also changed the table underneath the TV and put that table outside on the porch. I then put down carpet to decorate a little bit and I put down planter, a planter box um, on the porch and um, the um, garden, gardening like florist thing um, that we have decoration um, there as well um, just so yeah there would be something there and I think um, the porch is a good space to have a little bit of like a gardening patch basically and then I did the outside I um, used the um, bushes and like um, flowers that were already there um, because yeah why not I didn't want to change too much I wanted to update it make it a little bit prettier or at least what I thought looked prettier and um, yeah, that, that's why I still wanted to use it. Um, I also um, put down a sink in the bathroom. I hadn't um, done that yet. Um, I used the counters that were in the kitchen as the counters for the bathroom and I um, like sold the bathroom sink that was originally in that build. So I still needed a sink in the counters. So put that down and outside I also put down a monkey bar set 
um, I re really wanted something outside for the kids as well. Um, so yeah, put that down. And I saw that the monkey bar set is a really nice touch. It's a quite large item, so it fills the space. Um, but it's not as expensive as the other playground equipment uh, things that we have. Um, but still, I needed to save some money before I could buy that. Um, and yeah, I think I managed in the end and um, to round it up, basically, I put down some terrain painting um, underneath the table and also underneath the um, bushes and flowers. Um, so it looks more natural. And then I was finished. Now you can see some screenshots of the build. I hope you like it. You can download it from the gallery. My ID is TGG Sims, same as my YouTube channel name. I also hope that you liked the video and will consider pressing the thumbs up button and subscribing. Thanks very much for watching and have a great week. Bye!